A search is ongoing tonight for a man who went missing near a Newburyport boating club. 33-year-old Kevin Mahoney of Newbury was last seen early Saturday morning and was reported missing last night. Good evening to you. I'm Ken McLeod. The Coast Guard, State Police, and the Harbor Master are all involved in the search now. Here's WBZ's Zania Maldonado. In the water, on the ground, and in the air. The search continues in Newburyport for 33-year-old Kevin Mahoney. Police say Mahoney was last seen near the North End Boat Club around 1.30 a.m. Saturday morning, wearing this outfit, a pink button-down shirt, khaki shorts, and tan shoes. By 7.30 p.m. Saturday night, his family reported him missing. We searched the area last night um, uh, on the grounds here at the boat club. Um, briefly, it was obviously it was very dark and there's a lot of marsh. Police say Mahoney may have been intoxicated. His backpack, cell phone, and keys were all found aboard his family's boat, which was docked at the club. He was with his girlfriend, and uh, you know they were out late. They were here at the boat club. They frequented another area in town here, and then they came back this area. There was some kind of conversation between the two, and they got split up. Newburyport Police and Fire, State Police, and the U.S. Coast Guard all aiding in the search, which took a pause Sunday afternoon due to unsafe conditions in the water. Online, more than 800 people have joined the Friends Searching for Kevin Mahoney Facebook group, and a GoFundMe page has been set up to raise money for a private investigator. They wanted people with drones to come down and just kind of search, look around, see if they could find anything. We spoke to a local resident who wished to remain off camera. She says she's witnessed a number of drownings take place by the docks over the years. People come here, they don't understand how horrible this current is. Um, and once you go in, I mean, I think it's very difficult to get out. It's, it's sad every time. It's just, it happens so much. Police say the search will continue as long as conditions in the water remain safe. They say they're also reviewing surveillance footage in the area and are asking anyone with information to contact them immediately. In Newburyport, Zania Maldonado, WBZ News.